a little bit of this. A hint of dangerous chemicals. So when you think of soaps, you think of beautiful colours and flowery fragrances. But it's actually hardcore. Some... So when you think of soaps, you think of beautiful colours and flowery fragrances. But it's actually hardcore. All right, so we've got our safety gear on and we have our soap expert, Valerie, here. Now, Valerie, why are we being so safe today? Well, when we're doing soap making, we're actually using some chemicals that could be dangerous. So the, the, the sodium hydroxide we're using, which is called, called caustic soda, is, has a pH of about 12. That, if it gets on your skin, can burn you. And if ingredients are introduced in the wrong order, they can even explode. Did you hear that? They can even explode. So don't try this without any safety gear or a professional. So this is sodium hydroxide. You do not want to touch it with your hands. You do not want to get it on your skin. And when it's mixed with water, it's going to make a very uh, oh, dangerous liquid, really. Okay. Okay. And Luckily. that's exactly what we're going to do with it. We're going to mix it with water. But we're not going to tip water into here because if we did, it would literally explode. It would like spit out and explode. So the, uh, the powder mixes easily into water if it's poured in. So we're just going to pour it in. Not only is it quite caustic and it will burn you from a chemical point of view, uh, it actually gets very hot. So you can actually hear it sizzling. Can you hear it? Yeah. yeah. So just feel how hot that is. Wow. This is some pretty hardcore scientific stuff. Now stir and dissolve very gently and let it cool down a bit from that crazy high temp. So while we're waiting for it to cool down, we're going to get our oils ready because we're going to mix our oils and our lye solution that we've just made together in the mixer at the right temperature. So the next thing to do is to get our oils ready. Cue oil melting montage. We've got a little of a lot of different sustainable oils in the mix. So if you get a soap that doesn't have any extra fat in at all, then it's just soap. It's really good at cleaning, but maybe a little bit harsh on the skin. So when you're soap making, you can choose to super fat your soap. This kind of soap is going to be super fat with a pH. All right, so now we have our oils in the mixer and our solution. And we need to add them together now that they're at the same temperature. So pour it in slowly. Wish me luck. All right, here we go. <laughs> it's sounding like it's doing some pretty crazy things in there. It is. It's mixing like crazy. So now we're going to leave it for 10 minutes oh. to mix. Right. And then we'll check it to see if it's ready. Time's up. All right, what do we do next? All right, we'll turn off the mix before we take the cloth off so we don't splash ourselves. Yes. And we have a look at it. So let's have a look at this and see if it's ready. It looks completely different now. Just undo it and bring it over here. It looks really creamy. So let's have a look at scents first. Convenience, we're going to use one scent for both of them. What scents? I've got all kinds of choices in here. I've got lemon. I've got bergamot, rosemary, lavender, lime, well, pine. I, um, so, uh, well, Val, I think I need to choose the most hardcore scent of all. That would have to be lavender. OK, Grandma. OK, moving on. Add the lavender oil. And then the best bit, colour. Hardcore colour, naturally. And then we wait some more. Look at that. That's, that. a, that's, that's great. Oh, well. See, so you've got all those swirly, and this end is completely different to that end. Yeah. Well, I guess when it comes to soap, you know, with all the smells and the colours even, I guess the sky's the limit, Val. That's right. But sadly, we have got to wrap it up. If you want more awesome adventures, hit up template.com.au to watch all of our episodes online. And check out our socials for all the behind-the-scenes pics and vids. Until we do this again, stay wild.